Hello there my brothers and we can actually see the new load screen of the Kaiser Reich. And the new load screen is dedicated to the Ottoman Empire. And there we can see the Ataturk or Mustafa Kemal Pasha. Ah, he is just smoking cigarette. But anyway, today we won't play Turkey, we are going to play Switzerland. And it's not going to be the main Switzerland, the boring Switzerland. We are going to lose our lands and after that take them back to us. And actually, we are going to bring Eugen Birker and his National Populist Party of Switzerland. And of course, we will have war with the French Commune. So, let's start our campaign and enjoy! Kaiserak, Kaiserak is just as always, it has no sounds for the forces. Kaiserak developers, please, if you watch me, add sounds to the forces, please. Cause without sound forces it looks boring. Ah, Switzerland, classic. The state of the Switzerland, it's not correctly, it's the Swiss Confederation, the only one confederation in the whole world. And there you can read just our boring history about our neutrality in the whole world crack and about the, our occupation of the Upper Savoy. And actually it's a legitimate occupation cause after the Napoleonic Wars we had opportunity to occupy the Upper Savoy if something bad will happen in the France. The bad thing has happened. Communards have taken power in the France, so we have occupied the Upper Savoy. And the most interesting thing is that at the beginning of the 1936 we still don't recognize the French Communards, we recognize only French Republic as the legitimate French government. I actually saw that Ottoman Empire was updated in the new update with the Armenia and a few more countries. But since the last time I played, I saw that Albania changed the, their color, Middle Africa has changed color, as well as Philippines. So yeah, let's see the new gameplay. Cause soon we are going to have pretty interesting campaign as the Ottoman Empire. We are going to choose the secret PS of the Ottoman Empire in the Kaiserreich. If you wanna see it, please put the likes on this video and write comments about it. I'll understand that you really want to see the secret PS of the Ottoman Empire. So this is my first campaign for two months and we already have the Russian Civil War. Why am I not surprised? And I actually forgot to tell you the most important information. It's our population. Now, our population is 4.3 million people living in the Switzerland. But after occupation of our territories we will lost more than 1 million people. And our population is gonna be 3.2 million people living in the Switzerland. That's not enough. Uh, but at least it's more than the population of Estonia. Oh and yeah, that's the situation in the Haiti Savoy that I described to you at the beginning of the video. I actually like the system of the referendums. Now we have the fourth official language. The Romanish language is now official language of the Switzerland. Whoa, a new button of joining alliances. Actually, it looks good. Oh, 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 and that's a good man. I would elect him as the president. As the president and is the leader of the Switzerland. And he see the horrors of the socialism and their ideas are spreading in our country. And it's not good. It's not good for the Switzerland. It's actually good for the French Commune, but not for the Switzerland. Oh, nice, the third referendum is successful, cause we have fucked up the second. Now we can do that. Yay! And there we get the new Mr. President in the United States, Mr. Long. Mr. Long now is the President of the United States. And we wish luck to our brothers from America. Cause Long's movement is not far away from the national populism. Yeah, it's different, but still, 
America the first is authoritarian democrats, and we are the national populists. The first thing that the situation in the Switzerland isn't going good is that the socialist election victory in Romandie. Damn those socialists. The second thing is that socialists propose reconciliation with France. The third bill is an illegal referendum in Savoy. The fourth thing is that the syndicalists claim referendum victory. This is our new field marshal. We trust him. Oh, hungry! Hi there! It's the new civil war in the Austrian Empire. Now it looks funny cause they all are white and hungry is green. Strange green color. Now it's the most important case, decent in Romandy province in the French ultimatum. There you should click the second button to get the interesting ending. Cause if you accept the French claims you'll just give them the upper Savoy and that's gonna be ended, you are going to have the middle scenario, peace and reconciliation. You will just recognize the French commoners, border with them and that's all. But Romandie will stay with you and you'll have a democratic government. Now we're looking for the protection and the only one who can protect us now is the German Empire. If they will protect us, it's gonna be bad. If they won't protect us, that's gonna be good. Fuck. Let's do the second try. So to save our campaign, let's make a little change and Germany will invade Denmark for some reason. We don't know why, but Germany will do that. Just imagine that uh, Denmark has sold a bit surströmming to the German Empire and they just want to punish Denmark. And now, while Germany is at war and while Austria is at war, we have left alone and no one will help us. The powers of the world have their own struggles, of course. And now just, yes, enemies on all sides. So yeah, you just need uh, to German Empire go into the war and Austrian Empire go into the war. Austrian Empire went to the war by itself, but German Empire just invaded Denmark for some reason. And yeah, after taking the Upper Savoy, as I expected, we have the Romandi secedes, traitors, all of them. Uh, goodbye Romandi. And actually it's a catastrophic situation for the Switzerland. We have lost everything. But now we will develop our country in the other way. And we are going to have a great revenge. Reclaim the nation. But for the next few years we are going to be just a frenzy farm. We will develop Switzerland, eat cheese and drink wine. That's all. So after this focus from the our focus tree line, the democracy in the Switzerland, cause of its no efficiency, will be ended up. And we will have the Schweizer Reich, Schweizer Rische, Vaterlandische Verband. Verband. German language is just wow. To read Spanish name, it's actually way more easier. Republica Socialista Federativa Sovietica de Mexico is even more funny than the Schweizer or Österreich. Nationalist coup. Bye bye, democratic government. Switzerland needs no allies. And now we have the Eugen Bircher, and his portrait was updated too. And yeah, right now we are not so popular, but in the future we are going to have 100% of the popularity in Switzerland. Bye bye, horrors of the socialism. Now they are destroyed. And I don't think that we need to change our flag. I like that flag that we have right now, so let's maintain it. Our flag is like a brand of our country and everyone knows Swiss flag. <laughs> Classic, the new order, old world blues. So the great trail under the French communards and under the Swiss traitors is coming. Now our nation is secured and as you can see, we don't need to be a black spot of the Europe. It's boring and it's not the great Swiss pass. Oh, and that's actually, that's the great Swiss pass. Reclaim the nation. It's not by hiding in our homes and bracing for the coming tides that we shall weather the storm. 
it's by taking what and has always been rightfully ours. The people must be united behind a common cause, and this cause is to take what our enemies have stolen from us. Oh, and now we have the popularity almost 100% in the Switzerland. Hey dude, nice civil war you have. Let me just occupy the Aosta Valley, and I won't hurt you. Um, uh, it's fall 1940, where is my world Krieg? But still, the Kingdom of France didn't declare war on the German Empire. Once I said it and the Russian Socialist Republic declared war on the German Empire. And that means that Russia has started the Second World Krieg. Let's see who will win. Cause I don't actually know what to expect from Russian Socialist Republic. Whoa! And that scene? I haven't seen before, Belarusian People's Republic, Soviet Russia have even gave them a few territories. So they have actually betrayed the German Empire. Interesting moment. Yeah, 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 as I said, betrayal in the Reichspakt. White Ruthenia, German's small Ostwall puppet state, has defected to the international. Germany's empire crumbles. And that's a new event, I like that. Oh, and yeah, the second world crack has fully started. The Kingdom of France declared war on the German Empire. But I didn't actually see that. We have a good news from the south. Italian National Republic destroyed Socialist Republic of Italy. What can be better than it? Now we need to destroy only the Kingdom of France. So at the end of the year 1940 we have decided to help our German brothers to liberate France and to help them to defeat the French Communards. And at 25 days we are going to intervene the Second World Krieg and liberate free people too, and liberate people too, and liberate too, and liberate people too, and liberate people and liberate people from the horrors of the socialism. The end of the Swiss neutrality, despite our best efforts to avoid foreign intelligence and conflicts, Switzerland has found itself embroiled in a war. Our neutrality, maintained for over a hundred years, has finally been broken as men young and old are called up in the service of their country. Today we fight. So the war for the liberation of our territories has started. Yeah, they tried to break our defensive, but they won't do it. March 1941, the situation looks like this. We have lost two states, but actually we are doing okay. We have a good news for the Reichspakt, so the Ottoman Empire, Ottoman Brothers have joined the Reichspakt and that will change the whole Eastern Front. Cause look, now Georgia has connection with the Ottoman Empire, so Germans can now bring their forces right here as well as the Ottomans and the Russians should bring a lot of forces to defend the Ottoman Empire areas like Dagestan and other parts of the Northern Caucasus. Plus, Iran is the puppet of the Ottoman Empire, so new front line will be opened in the Central Asia. What about us? We have lost Zurich. And that's actually not good. France begs for mercy. There are high spirits all around us. France delegation arrived today with the intent to negotiate a peace between our two nations. It's no secret that the war is going very poorly for the French, and they are surely eager to the end to the war as soon as possible. This would be a great opportunity to demand more out of them. I would like to treat the second option, cause with that we can size the rest of Savoy. This as just a fact I actually don't need, cause come on, Germans are breaking the French defense, so by the end of this year German forces will capture Paris. It's not even a joke. They gave me all territories that I actually wanted. Cause yeah, at the beginning we wanted to conquer the Upper Savoy, the Lower Savoy and Romandie. And that's all that they wanted to have from the France, so now we will move to the war with the Italian National Republic, cause from them we need to take Austawale to build a great Switzerland. Oh, and we got back the fate of Haiti Savoy. We can also crack down on the syndicalists and integrate the Haiti Savoy and integrate the main Savoy. Second World Krieg was a really good opportunity to reborn the great Switzerland. 
in the what about the population? Now the population of the whole Switzerland is almost 5 million people. And that's good enough for us. Mm. I signed the peace only with the French Commune, yeah, but not with the Union of Britain. So now we will continue the war with the Communards. And that's not good for us. But still, we will help the German forces to crash French Commune. Now we are holding on good enough and we even go and take back our lands that was conquered at the beginning of the new war. This is December 1941 and we are storming Marseille. Now it's a Swiss city and we have access to the sea. And these forces, they are going to die. Minus four divisions. So let's deal with the Italians cause we have a war goal. And I think that we can hold their offensive and then start our counteroffensive going down to the Rome. At least, let's try. And of course they started uh, their attacks. Oh, it's minus coming France and our front with the Italian Federation will be smaller. Let it be, we'll just take Alps and maybe Nitz? I don't know. Yeah, now we have access to the sea. Switzerland has access to the sea. Obviously I have taken everything that I need. So now from Italy I want to take not only the Aosta Valley, but a good part of the Italy. Oh, and Germany have created their own France. August 1942 and the situation on the Italian front line looks like this. We have captured a major city Turin, but that's all our successes. And actually we have lost Ticino and eastern Switzerland. Finally Italy has capitulated. We even needed to go to the Sicily. So I would like to annex the northern Italy and the southern Italy will stay with the Italy just. And I see this border like this, so we have created two Sicilies in the Papal State. But these territories, the richest territories of the Italy, will go to me. And the Swiss state now have access to the two seas plus a great coastline. Imagine starting from the small Switzerland which have given territories to the France. And now we are the GigaChat Swiss state. Like now we have the population of 35 million people living in the great Swiss state. And that's actually cool. But again, if we had Lyon, our population would be even 37 million people. But anyway, we have destroyed stupid Italians and created the agrarian state of Italy. Stupid agrarians liberated Pope. And now we can treat our milk chocolate with everyone. Cause now we have free access to the sea, to the Adriatic Sea and to the Mediterranean Sea. So yeah, brothers, thanks for watching, thanks for watching the great Swiss company and yeah, bye.